Right, here we go again. The first cars are dropping off. And all the other cars decide to park on the zigzags. And we'll see what we can get. Now all these cars, if you watch some of them, you'll see they have decals like the one going out of the square there. From firms in Newcastle, Sunderland, Middlesbury, Stockton. Now when these taxi drivers see the buses go all the way around, because they are parked on the zigzags, When these people take money out of the city, like they are doing, that means jobs for people in the city are gone. Because if it was local drivers there, they'd be spending it in local shops, local cafes, local restaurants, local pubs and other local businesses where you work. Twenty-four of these cars from out of the county can take a million pounds of investment away from the city every year. There's no parking around the corner. There's no parking between the lights. Why, except for the years, because the police ignore it. Their job. The car parked there. And he's going back after he was talking to the driver through the window. Ah, there's another one that takes place. See, they have some mayhem up there at the moment. And it can get worse. All of this is the cause of the County Council and the police. Making orders without properly consulting the trade. And I don't mean that two penny every working group they've got. I've been to one of them, and it's a joke. It's basically you sit there, you can have a little bit of a question. Well, I'll move straight on so you can't get a proper answer. And we'll just ignore you anyway. Because despite the last meeting being told one thing, they've decided now that they're going to do it. Even though the majority of the taxi drivers there said no. But that's Durham County Council and the Labour Party. Not that I like any politician. But our local Labour Party is the worst. <laughs>